I'm going to show you how to make this really cute block. It's very easy and simple. Um, it's even more easier if you use a jelly roll. I make lots and lots of YouTube tutorials. I'm fast approaching 500 YouTube tutorials. So don't forget to hit the subscribe button and you will find lots and lots of quilting and sewing videos. If you're looking for a really quick and easy jelly roll quilt to do, this is really fun. So what is a jelly roll? A jelly roll is basically 40 strips of fabric and they are two and a half inches wide this way and 40 inches by the width of the fabric. So this is a whole jelly roll pack that I got. I have some scraps here that I'm going to sew together, but generally you would use the whole width. So I'm just going to show you on these scraps what I'm doing. So I'm going to lay them out in a fashion that I like. So pretend these are full strips. And then I am going to sew together these strips right along here. For my sewing tutorials, I always use my Baby Blocks Pro. I'm not paid or sponsored to create this video. In my top thread, I will have a regular Gutemann polyester thread, just regular everyday sewing thread. My bobbin thread, I will have the Gutemann in there. I also have my sewing foot, um, quarter inch foot with guide on to get that perfect quarter of an inch. And I also have a Microtech sewing needle. This is actually an 8012. My stitch length is on a 2.5 and I'm just going to get this lined up in my sewing machine here and then I'm just going to attach these two together Once these are attached I don't bother to press just yet I leave it right to the end so then I'm going to attach this section here and I'm going to sew this right sides together now when I say right sides together it means put the two designs together or the pretty sides together any way that you want to call it so you're basically looking on the wrong side of the fabrics whenever you're actually sewing something in order to attach it so I'm going to sew all the way down here and then you're going to do the last one so I'm going to put that right sides together and sew down here now you're going to turn your iron on and then you're going to Press your seams so they're nice and flat. Now I'm going to square this up to the dimensions that I want it to be. So I know from here to here it's eight and a half. So I'm going to make it an eight and a half inch square block. So you're going to go ahead and make two of these at least. You need to make them in multiples of two. So what you're going to do is have one going across and one going up and down. And you're going to place them right sides together and then what we're going to do is we're going to take it over to the sewing machine and you are going to sew all the way around this block so you're going to sew all the way around it now from one corner to the other corner you're going to cut And then line up this corner here so you're cutting it straight down the middle there see what I've done I've lined this corner up here with this top bit up here I'm gonna do the same with this other one do it this way And cut. Now when you open this up you have a finished block and you've got some going this way and you've got some going this way. It's really quite effective. I'm going to press this out and these bits here are referred to as dog ears so you can just take them off finished size on this one is five and a half by five and a half so remember we cut it from an eight and a half inch block and now it's 
five and a half by five and a half. So I'm just going to press out all these other ones. Then we can see what it kind of looks like when we're finished. So you can make this into a cushion, you can go ahead and make it into a quilt. It's totally up to you. You do you. And then we just have to take these, these dog ears off again. Honestly, you can just have a play with it. And have you seen how it creates this diamond shape and this square shape? You can make it into loads of different methods that you want. Like so. So that's how you can make a really quick and easy quilt and you have a really effective and easy design. Hope you've enjoyed it.